So let's figure out, this is kind of like the body, right? Yeah. And then maybe it goes like that. As our children age, it's very difficult to find things for them to be involved in. And not all of our kiddos can just go out in the community and get jobs and have success at it. It's so important that we have a place where they can go and they can feel safe and they can feel good about themselves. The Ark of the Capital Area was started in 1949 by concerned parents who wanted to help their children with intellectual and developmental disabilities have the same opportunities as their other kids. Over the years, we've primarily been a case management agency. And about 10 years ago, we started an art program. Be it painting, drawing, dancing, theater, it helps them express things that they might not be able to say to anyone. A gives time as well. Right, you're almost there, you're That's almost there. Right. Being a, a member of the art studio has made her feel like she's a normal part of society because she knows she's different. But this has brought a normalcy to her. She has something that belongs to her. He just loves the people. He loves the staff. He loves his friends. You come here and there is no judgment. There is no criticism. It's a very open, inclusive environment. Everyone feels welcome. When we have a new student come in, they might be shy or not comfortable with a certain media. And I go down there three months later and the student is alive. I get to see vibrancy. I think that's a feather, all right? And they sprayed everything around it. They probably just taped this onto the block. So we can use the positive and the negative shapes as we're making them. One of the things I think that separates us from other nonprofits is that we're not just looking for community contributions. We want to create something that's sustainable. We want to create a service that we can give back to the community. We started a partnership this past year with Austin Community College and their continuing ed program to become a satellite site so that we could provide arts education classes. The revenue we receive from those classes helps us hire the teachers and hire the case managers so that we won't need to be dependent on Medicaid or contributions from the community. Our students not only get the opportunity to express themselves in their own personal and unique way, but in addition to that, we pay commission to all of our artists on the work that they do. Somebody really likes my artwork enough to buy it, and that's important for these guys to see a paycheck. The individuals that we have the opportunity to work with have potential. We give them the tools and the support that they need so that they can go out and live the life they want to. And with contributions from the community and the support from the community, these things can actually happen. What do you love about the ARC? I love the teachers. What do you love about them? It teaches everything. Because I love coming here. I make new friends. It gets me out of the house. That's right. She is great. <laughs> okay. It makes her happy. And what else do we want for our children but to be happy?